What is up, Autograph Nation? TTM Troy here from ttmautograph.com, and I'm so glad you're here with me today. I have some great through the mail or TTM autographs to share with you today, and there are some autographs that I've gotten in the past, so 2022, because I am still going through a lot of my 2022 returns for you here on the channel, but good news is most of these are retired players, whether hockey, baseball, or whatevs, <laughs> and so chances are that they do still sign as long as they've not passed away or, or moved or what have you, but hey, hopefully this gives you some ideas for who you want to send out some requests to. So let's go to the first request or the first return right here. You don't have to request anything from me other than, Troy, get going with this thing, and so here we go, boom. All right, first we have Sean Chambers. He signed three of three in 64 days. Now I sent these on October 9th of 2022 and received them on December 12th of 2022. Now uh, the address for Mr. Chambers is on Sports Card Forum. There you go. <laughs> now he was drafted in the 87 NHL Supplemental Draft, say that three times fast and played from 1987 to 2000 for the North Stars, the Capitals, the Lightning, the Devils, and the Dallas Stars. And he is the only player to be selected in supplemental draft to win the Stanley Cup, which he did in 1999 when he was with the Stars. So, very cool. Again, three of three from Mr. Sean Chambers in 64 days. Next, we have Troy Gamble. Very nice name. He signed two of two in 172 days. Let me make sure. I only have one here, so I think I lost one somewhere. <laughs> anyway, uh, I sent these on June 19th of 2022 and received that on December 8th of 2022. And the address for Troy, again, very nice name, is on Sports Card Forum. Now he was drafted 25th overall in 1985, and he played from 86 to 96 for only one team, the Vancouver Canucks. And he spent most of his career in the minors. So uh, he also did color commentary for the Houston Arrows, and his son Garrett uh, unfortunately passed away at age 20 when he was serving in Afghanistan. So very sad. Uh, but again, Troy Gamble, apparently two of two. I only have one of one here in my hand. In 172 days. Next we have a TTM legend, Brad Arnsberg. He signed two of two in 22 days. Now he sent these on August 26th of 2022 and received them on September 17th of 2022. And you can see the address for Mr. Arnsberg right there in Arizona. Now, Brad was drafted ninth overall in the 1983 draft and played from 86 to 92 for the Yankees, the Rangers, and the Indians. And then he went on to coach for the Expos and the Marlins, uh, where he helped the Marlins to a World Series win. Uh, oh, he also played our coach for the Blue Jays and the Astros as well. And he's currently, as of 2022, I guess, uh, an assistant coach for the Reds. So. There you go, Brad Arnsberg there in Arizona. He had a win-loss record of nine and six with a 4-2-6 ERA and 100 strikeouts. Brad Arnsberg. Next we have Bruce Benedict. He signed two of two in 11 days, but again, I only have one of one here in my stack here. So hopefully those other two show up. If they do, I'll do a video about them. Sorry about that. Uh, again, in 11 days. Now, I sent these on August 27th of 2022 and received them on uh, September 7th of 2022. So you can see the address for Bruce Benedict right there in Georgia. Now, he was drafted in the fifth round of the 76 MLB draft and went on to play from 1978 to 1989, uh, all for the Braves, where he was a two times all star in 1981 and 1983. Now during his career, he had a .242 batting average with 18 home runs and 260 
RBIs. And he has also coached and scouted uh, with the Mets, White Sox, and Cardinals organizations. So there you go. Mr. Bruce Benedict, two of two in 11 days or one and one, whatever I figure out. <laughs> so thank you again, Mr. Bruce Benedict. And thank you for watching my TTM returns today. You know, I'm really glad that you showed up to watch these videos. I really appreciate it. And I really appreciate all the comments that you guys have been giving me lately. And part of that is, uh, you know, it helps me decide, you know, hey, what, what should I do on this channel for 2024? You know, I've been doing kind of the same thing uh, for many years. I started on YouTube in 2012. And the first time when I first started, uh, I just gave my returns, right? And uh, after that, and you can go back in my channel and watch some of those videos. Those, those are pretty crazy. And then uh, after that, I started giving the stats. <clears throat> and I think I was one of the first channels to do that. And then I started giving the addresses out as well because I, I figured, you know, people don't want to just see your returns. I mean, I'm sure you guys uh, like seeing the returns and that's all great but part of that is hey how can I get a return like that as well and so that's where I try to give you the address if it's on a free site or if I if it's on a paid site just tell you what what site I got those from and then you can decide if you want to actually subscribe to that pay site or not <laughs> it's totally up to you if you want to do that or not but I figure that's uh, kind of useful and then I also have some FAQs, some frequently asked questions. And I do have some updates that I want to do. I want to update my how to send a TTM. I want to update, uh, add some more of those frequently asked questions. And luckily for me, I've been wearing the same shirt for I don't know how long. If you haven't noticed, uh, I, I kind of wear the same thing all the time. And that just kind of helps me get in the mood for the TTMs with my Babylon, uh, soft, Babylon 5 softball jersey. And uh, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll change that up in 2024. We'll see. But then you guys might not know whose channel is, this is. You might, you might think this is Chase or, or Scott or, or someone. So that's why I wear this, so you know who I am. Actually, it's just easier to wear the same thing all the time. But anyway, thank you so much for watching, as always. Uh, I haven't done this for a while, but if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, it helps me, it gives me that little gratification to know that I'm doing something well. And as I'm so fond of saying, and I mean it from the bottom of my heart, may your mailboxes be full and your stamps forever. Bye-bye.